Hello, I'm Aldersom, the chef sommelier from Le Bernardin and Aldersom Wine Bar. Today I wanted to show you how to decant a, wine, a bottle of wine properly. Uh, first of all, uh, the reason why we want to decant is uh, to separate the wine of the sediment which appears you know, from non-filtering or uh, with bottle aging. Therefore, you have your bottles always stored properly uh, horizontally and with the label always facing up. The sediment would lay down here. And what you don't want to do, that's why uh, we want to really gently touch the bottle and have it also here in this cradle. Uh, what you don't want to do is basically put the bottle upside down because like that you will mix up the sediment and that makes this whole process uh, unnecessary. The reason why we remove the sediment because you have this kind of sandy sensation, which is not a, it's fine, some people love the sediment, but I'd like to have it separated and we still prefer the wine with the sediment, totally fine, but it will taste slightly different. Uh, what you need for that is um, you need two coasters, you know, with a decanter. Uh, I use lately a flashlight because it's cleaner, but you can do it with a candle. Uh, you theoretically can even use your iPhone light uh, for the home use, not for the restaurant use. Uh, you need a wine key and uh, a glass for yourself. So the way how we start out is I lighten up the, my flashlight and cut the foil basically right here on the second lip without moving the bottle. That's where most people have a little difficulties. Again, I cut the knife here, turn my hand around and do it like that. And basically just peel the foil off. I put it always in a pocket, but you can literally also throw it here. I have a towel and basically clean for the first time because here can be a lot of, uh, uh, a little bit seepage or some dirty components. Now we open the bottle smoothly without really moving the bottle too much. I smell. I prefer with smelling on the cork because it gives me a little indication whether the wine is corked or not. Uh, technically correct, you would basically take down the cork with the towel. Uh, for speed reasons, I use always. Um, my hand perfectly done is with the towel take it off you don't want to touch something what the customer touches as well I clean the second time pour a little bit in my glass just again it's less than an ounce the wine smells clean I season the decanter because decanters can be a little bit tricky it's very hard to wash them uh, very often they stand in your shelf they pick, take on the smell of that shelf or the odor of that shelf and then it, the wine affects it too. I taste it as well because look, it's like cooking at home. Before you basically plate the sauce, you want to make sure your sauce is seasoned properly and seasoned right. Before I serve the wine, I taste it first. Why? Because what's the point of giving the customer a corked wine or an oxidized wine and he has to complain. We take this out right away and we give the 100% product to our clients. Now basically I grab the bottle, turn it smoothly around, leave it in the same angle and hold the bottle here right over the flashlight. So if there's sediment I will see it, if there's not I pour everything into the bottle. And I will hold basically the light here straight uh, just into the neck so I'll see before the sediment will come. It's just a little tiny bit. Put it to the plate. I always do a check if it's really properly clean. And turn off my light. And we'll start the service now. So enjoy.